Good morning, good afternoon, good night everybody. It's Jojo and unfortunately we're leaving Shanghai Disneyland today. But before we go, we gotta get breakfast. So we came back to Disney Town and honestly, it's really nice right now. It's Monday, so it seems a lot less busy. Out of all the Disney Lego stores I've seen in the world, this one is definitely the coolest. I gotta show you all of them. Look at this, starting with the aliens. Mulan and Mushu, do you see how big this is? These are Legos. But wait, there's a second floor. Mickey Mouse. The Magic Kingdom represent. Oh my goodness, I didn't even know this store. Iron Man and Captain America. I don't know how he's flying, but they have the whole city behind them. Mowgli and the snake from Jungle Book. We got up. Oh my gosh. And their house. Ratatouille. Another Aliens and the Buzz Lightyear. Also, you can see them at the top here. Hello. Hard to see, but there's Aladdin and Abu in a Legos. Last but not least, Jasmine and Raja. This Lego set is great, man. Also, this view is lovely. Honestly, I'm missing American food right now, so the Cheesecake Factory is the closest thing we can get. I'm excited. Maybe I'm just going crazy, but the smells of the food are reminding me of America right now. You happy you're here? Finally, dude. I'm gonna get some pasta, I'm gonna grub up, I'm gonna feel good. Just in case any of my cheesecake fanatics out there are curious what the menu looks like, I'm talking to you, Swoozy. Yep, they have their glam burgers, so pretty authentic to America. We have spotted our first difference, butter. Apparently, G ordered cheesecake before his entree. I'm hungry, man. Food is coming quick. Poor cheese, pasta, and I got spicy vodka sauce. The one place I definitely want to try next time is Donald's Dining Delights. This just looks cool, you know? They have the whole like feast Thanksgiving set. World of Disney. Wow. It's so more spacious in here. I feel like I can actually breathe. Hello, sheep. Oh, I don't want to leave yet. So I went around the store and made a couple TikToks. This is adorable. All of this is adorable. This is adorable. We gotta get out of here. Yeah, we're gonna keep spending money, man. It's a nice day in the park. And there's the big Donald Duck in the distance. Let's go say hi. Hey, Jojo, I got you something. Yeah. Oh. Whoa. Oh. Whoa, good catch. <laughs> this is cute, but Donald Duck's not big enough. How about that? <laughs> Now that's big enough. Look at him. He's so big. It's Donald Duck. <laughs> Goodbye, Shanghai Disney. Quick morning. Well, it wasn't quick. I bought a ton of stuff, but... Let's get to the hotel, man. Let's get out of Disney. I need a Disney detox. Gotta get to that bus. I'm about to miss it. Goodbye, Disney. I'll miss this place. Hi, Woody. Hi, Buzz. Hi, Bud. <laughs> hello, hello. Uh, to infinity and beyond, yeah? <laughs> Your hat you is very cute. <laughs> uh, what, should we pose with like this, yeah? Yes, this pose. Right, very cool. Good. I look at here. One, two, three. Okay, cool. We can change your pose. Right. Let's Ooh. look Woody. Gotcha. Okay, good. Hey, it's Woody and Buzz. Best way to end our trip here in Shanghai Disney is, is with these two. <laughs> See you later, guys. Have a good day. <laughs> this thing is like, Yeah, you guys have a magical day too. Bye. Ah, uh, perfect way. We started with them, we ended with them. So Ubers don't work here, and we don't know Chinese. So we're asking the receptionist desk to book us a taxi. While we're waiting, I figured I'd make one more stop in Sunnyside Market. Hello to get one more treat. We saw my eating vlog the other day. They have a ton of different treats, ice cream, but I want, hi, I want another Donald. This is good, I enjoy this. A little Christmas detail I didn't notice on arrival. Goodbye, bye. <laughs> it's time to go. Well, it's been a fun time, man. We're leaving? Yeah, we gotta go. I don't wanna leave Shanghai Disney. I want to stay. All right, all right. Enough of that. Mm. Fine. Bye. Bye. Thank you. <laughs> ah. Here we go. Oh. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>
well um yeah we're definitely not in the city <laughs> well this was jeet's uh airbnb again there's a whole amusement park out here right for us yep for sure how is this happening again oh man got some reservations in mind the pixie dust we're staying at the moon low hotel Huh, cute lobby. Reception was super nice. We're going to the third floor. That's where the guest rooms are. This place is beautiful. This is like a restaurant at nighttime. They got hot tea boiling. <laughs> Cheat really likes this place. I don't mind it either. It's cute. They have a nice little terrace. What's over here? There's another yeah, bird. And now look who wants to go explore. Yeah, uh, I'm not, mm, 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 I'm not mm, saying mm, it's mm, a bad spot. He just doesn't understand where we are. Not yet, at least. Books. I can't read Chinese. So what the hallways look like. You can tell they really uh, worked on this place, which is nice. It is. Got some cereal over there. This is where you can have breakfast and dinner. I've never been in a hotel like this. <laughs> This is really cool. 8.30, Here we go. Oh, wow. Yeah, High ceiling. Up. No, it's very nice. Yeah. It's very yeah, inviting. Wow, look at this. It's pretty cool. How's the shower? Oh, yeah. This is gorgeous. A little waterfall shower. Phenomenal. Sink. Yeah, it's very nice. Balcony too. What's this? Yeah, this room is really nice. Yeah. Open ceilings. A little balcony too. Oh yeah, this is gonna be just fine. Until you see how far we are away from the city, but it how is far, really nice. Forty-five minutes. Oh. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> but regardless, the hotel itself is very, very nice. Super quaint. And it was like it wasn't expensive either, so that's good. Definitely a great alternative when you're going to Shanghai Disney because it's only about like 20 minutes away from here. So that's really good. Definitely consider this place for yourself when you're coming. There's no Wi-Fi. There is Wi-Fi, but it's through China. So all the apps we use, YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, it's all blocked here. So the Wi-Fi is basically useless for us which means uh, we have to go on data, which fortunately do have an international travel plan. But the city is 45 minutes away. So regardless of all that, we're just gonna start working right now. Probably edit a vlog you've already seen. Well, we got some work done. You got a video of that so we know what room number we are? Yes. 8340. Now it's time to go to the city, which was our plan this all is along. Kind of scary looking, huh? Uh, yeah, kind of, <laughs> I don't wanna. It's time to, uh, <laughs> <I'm kidding. laughs> Get in our DD. That's what Uber is here. Whoa, that's sick. <laughs> it's like mini trampolines. She made the Uber go to the wrong spot. I'm gonna lose it, dude. I'm gonna lose my, I'm gonna snap. <laughs> I'm gonna snap. China has definitely been an interesting place for us to navigate. Like, honestly, we have no idea where we are. It's just, this has been easily the hardest travel with the language barrier. Yeah. Everywhere else, even Tokyo was manageable. This is very difficult. Like, I ordered to the wrong spot. Anywhere else, I can just call. Be like, hey, I put it in the wrong location. This, I can't do it. I'm not gonna say what I'm saying at all. So, I had to just cancel it and then buy a whole new one. We're just spending money left and right, man. Left and right. Our Uber has arrived. Yeehaw. Well, we made it to the city and we're going into this place right here. It used to be a speakeasy, the captain. In a tiny elevator once again, going up to a rooftop bar. Not as tall as the Hunter floor though. I just feel like we've seen this movie before. <laughs> just the fifth floor. <laughs> well, at six o'clock, the lights in the city actually turn on. We're on one side of the river 
Disney is on the other side of this river. This is like the old side of town. That's the new side, but like Disney is like past the city. So just to give you some geography, it's very pretty though. So I got the lost treasure. I I, I didn't know that this was so fancy. Anyway, there's Jeet. Uh, they're playing Drake right now. We have some new friends. Introduce yourself, what's your name? Hey, how's it going? I'm Brooks. And? Hi, I'm Peyton. And they showed us this amazing view. So uh, thanks for having us guys. We've been learning so much from them. <laughs> it's amazing. Kind of yes. Listen, you guys made our day so much better because we were down bad after the whole resort is situation. You win some, you lose some. Exactly. <laughs> Look at the architecture of these buildings. We're just starting to explore the city, but it's so pretty. This is pretty, dude. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty cool. This view is nuts. I, I would not expect Shanghai to look like this. Butterflies. Georgia, who takes a selfie by a wall, bro? <laughs> no, totally not me. <laughs> it is 8.56. This is crazy. Wow. This is nuts. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> They took our picture. Hey, and what pictures they were. <laughs> <laughs> That's nice. I love this place. <laughs> Look at oh. the view. <laughs> yeah. Last night was fun. It is the morning and we have breakfast. Um, I don't know what I want to eat. Definitely got some options though. Hmm. Shot milk. Ooh. They also got like an omelet slash noodle bar for the morning. The chefs, that's great. It's definitely a light breakfast for me, but I'm excited about the noodles. That's the best part. It really is a beautiful morning though. I haven't been vlogging as much, just kind of taking it in for what I can. Jeet woke up. <laughs> They've been very great to us. Just making sure we get served. What you got, Jeet? Um carbs nice <laughs> also i figured it out i'm on the wi-fi does it work yeah what, what'd you do i don't know i lost everything for a second <laughs> i had no connection right. now I, but now i'm reliant on this wi-fi because outside of this I, I don't get anything pan today right. I was doing it before. Um, there you go. I had no idea there was a switch. Hey, G, that's a pretty good view. Nice place, huh? You know, I mean, I've never said I didn't like it. Hey. Today's been weird. It's 3.30 and you might be wondering, Jojo, why are you still in your hotel room? Well, I was editing a vlog for you guys. I've had so many trials and tribulations. Are you peeing while I'm vlogging? Bad. Anyways, <laughs> it's tough. I, I, I had issues uploading. I had issues with copyright. I had issues with my actual software and then on top of it i don't have data and we're connected to uh china's wi-fi which has youtube and tiktok instagram basically all of my social media platforms banned so that was interesting to work around long story short we've been going and going and going with the disney and the traveling i did end up getting the video uploaded which is good so that video is out right now all right so please go watch it if you haven't already i i poured my blood sweat and tears into that one also we didn't pack correctly it's freezing outside we only have one hoodie that i bought from disney so now i'm playing a game how many ways can i wear the same clothes in a different order <laughs> it's been a day it's definitely a learning lesson for us when it comes to our travels, correct, Jeet? I would say that's a great way of putting it. Yeah, we'll do a whole recap when we get home. <laughs> but for now, let's go have some fun. Let's go into the city. Back outside. Um, so this is a mall. There are stores up here. You said this place is actually kind of nice. You explored it a little bit. Yeah, I went and got Starbucks. 
down the block. It's a nice area, it really is. Look, the things have TVs on them. Oh, <laughs> every day I'm learning something new about this. Oh, it's like a little shooting game. It's like Ant-Man and the Wasp. Also, they have a pharmacy and a supermarket right across the street, which is very convenient for us. Happy about that. There's actually like a ton of stores here. It's like a little strip. Also, Jeep called the DD away from the location that we were at, so we had to walk down the street. Look, a restaurant right there. It seems like there's just a lot of construction happening right now. Where are we? We're at Zoo Garden. What's it's, Zoo Garden? It's basically like a shopping district, a lot of food. Imagine going to like a like a fair, but it's like an everyday thing. Yeah, there's definitely a, a lot going on right now, to say the least. I take care of all the Disney, Jeet does the city stuff. So I, I, I literally have done no research. I, I can't tell you where we actually are right now or what I'm looking for. Let's go in. Okay, following you. I don't know which way to walk. I don't know which side <laughs> This is pretty cool though. All the little markets and stuff. Am I gonna buy anything? Probably not. No, part of the plan is to buy something and to also eat something. Okay, I can, I can get behind that. Wow. This is sick. This is China. Oh, so you like it, huh? I do like it. Uh, I feel like I'm in Epcot. What? <laughs> <laughs> String of candy haws on a stick. I don't know what candy haws are. Kind of like appetizing. Oh, strawberries. Okay. Candied strawberries. Got some juices. China definitely serves a lot of octopus. Like, that's octopus right there. That's octopus. Oh my goodness. Crazy. So much food. Oh wow. This place is truly massive. <laughs> it's a big shopping area. It's fun. I like it. I don't really want fried squid though. Hagen does. We're not gonna go here. Superman toy. Oh yeah, the Mickey Iron Man, that looks sick. <laughs> the Optimus Prime, that's going crazy too. Iron Man. Took a lot of gotcha stuff in there as well. Shock Choco. I think this is all made out of chocolate, like animals. What the heck? That's crazy. It's, yeah, it's chocolate, I can smell it. it smells good. This is kind of cool. We've entered a whole chocolate museum. And a store, of course. Dang. <laughs> There's a whole outside too with more food and it keeps just going down. Oh my gosh. I'm assuming this is beef jerky. It's called meat box. I'm gonna do a little sample tasting right now. Oh, thank you. We're gonna do a little sample right now. Cheers. Oh, it's good? Yeah, okay. Oh man. Yeah, yeah. This one? Sure. Thank you. Thank you. Shout out Jeep for downloading the WePay app. It's basically Venmo, but in China. Um, and it goes by weight. So we got a couple little slabs. I wish I had this like at home. It's delicious. I'm so happy. We got some beef jerky and now we found the bar. <laughs> I get the white beer from uh, Belgium. Sit there though, take that seat. This is about $4 and this jerky was too. But the cool thing is it comes in like, you know, you buy it, it comes in this nice little pack you can bring home, but then it also has a resealable case so that you carry it home with you like a gift bag, but then it's also a container for the jerky. I am happy. Which jerk did you get? Cause I want the one I got. Ooh, I is a happy man. Yummy. Sugar coated haws. Some cool pops. That's like the city building they have here. Also, apparently we Google translated, we're allowed to walk around with alcohol, so here goes nothing. Hopefully, we don't get in trouble. What the heck? It's a dinosaur. Another little swanky bar. I'm a little nervous. I don't like walking around with a beer. It's just, you know, America, you're not allowed to, so. Like I said, we asked, they said we can't, so. I'm just gonna try to drink it quick, regardless. Energy monster. Now, one thing we've learned about the culture is that people like live and breathe off their phone. Their wallets, their ID, everything is on their phone, so they have these, in restaurants, no matter where you go, your phone 
will be alive. Did you see this? It's gold. I, it's absolutely beautiful. I think an Instagram picture is a cult for. For anyone who can read Chinese, here's the map of the area. I think we're here. That's definitely us. Oh my goodness. I want the kebabs right now. We're definitely getting that. This whole place is just bustling. And some guy's making... What is he doing? Well, like, shaping. Oh my goodness. <laughs> There's just so much food everywhere. Just ready to go. It's so warm in here too. Wow. Dang, you could just come eat here every day of the week. I'm excited, I'm excited. Just cooking them up. Oh. Yeah, me. <laughs> okay, before I devour this, man, I gotta get an insta pick. All right, here we go. We're gonna try it. Lots of spice, obviously. It's good. Um, it's definitely giving me like steak vibes, but not like. I don't know. There's not too much flavor to the actual meats. It's seasoned well, and the, the temperature is good. That's all I could ask for. I mean, this is great. We found the McDonald's. Apparently, the menu is different here. Aww, and they have Disney 100 kids meal. I love the world sometimes. English. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Big Mac, fish burger. I have a lot of different combos. You can literally get a German sausage double beef burger combo. That's crazy. This menu is very different, especially from like Dubai's as well. Double thick Angus Max burger. <laughs> I want a double thick. Ooh, oh, the V wings? Wow. Crispy chicken with red oil, popcorn chicken, spicy McWing. Oh, I'm gonna get that. This is the best part. I can pay in foreign currency. Okay, I can use my credit card. I like the McDonald's tree. Anyway, we're downstairs now. This is huge. I love it. Got my pickup receipt. Just gotta wait to be called. If you didn't know, I ordered like the whole menu from Dubai's McDonald's a couple months ago. That was fun. Anyway, here's my thing. Fries, got some wings. G got like just one big wing. Look at this. They have a nice little lid so you can just sip your soda. Right next to the McDonald's is a jeweler since 1848 apparently it's really pretty inside and then next to that the starbucks <laughs> by the way i don't know if you noticed but this whole street's pedestrian only very fun cool spot for sure this is like one of the main entrances people get picked up right here and then they turn around i guess back into the main city there's a really pretty building over there it's sparkling jeet says it's the financial building i'm not sure if that's correct but you know Listen, have i ever been wrong we're meeting up with our friends from last night for trivia, but uh, Jeet wanted to check out this tunnel, ended up bringing us to the same location as na last night. Well, um, not the same exact spot. Well, no, it's the same exact spot. We uh, crossed that street last night. <laughs> oh, the buildings are so pretty. It's literally giving like Washington DC or, or something, I don't know. I'm getting Paris. Yeah, I could see that too, for sure. This is nuts. <laughs> Holy cow. We've made it to the Bund Sightseeing Tunnel. Oh, we're going down. That's crazy. Dang. So that's where we are. The tunnel literally takes you under the water to the new side of the city. We can't do this right now. We have trivia in less than 30. All right. Well, I mean, I, 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 I want to do it. In. We'll yeah. come back. Ride it over. Oh, this might be closed though, huh? Yeah, might have to save it for the next video. Well, we've arrived far away to uh, found 158. No, seriously, look, they're everywhere. This is wild. We didn't even see this. This is like under street level. Just more places to eat. We're going over here to the left. Yeah, El Santo for a trivia night. I'm so thankful that we actually have friends who are living here to show us these really cool spots. It's Taco Tuesday, half off drinks, half off tacos, 
and it's trivia, and if you win, you actually get a free bottle of wine, and it's free to play as well. We did Star Wars trivia. Taco Tuesday. Food. Drink. So you have to figure out. We're literally at the bottom. Uh, so we will go on a Chorizo taco. Apparently it's good. It's good, Jeet? It's phenomenal. Look at it, man. Let me show you. Look at that. Get in there. Wow. 16th century. This is not a normal taco. So, Brooks, you can pay into that. <laughs> said this is really good. And Jeet said this is really good. And also, Kate said. And also, Danny said. Hola. <laughs> I just grab it. Yeah. I just bite it. Okay. What? So, I'd like to, it's okay. a, what are you We're eating like a pizza. It's a All taco. Right. <laughs> Number three. Cheers, everybody. <laughs> We're learning so much today, G. I know. What did our education system not tell us? Everything. <laughs> Welcome to the British like educational system. <laughs> Welcome to you the know American what educational system. <laughs> I apologize for what we gave you as your education system. You should have stuck with us. <laughs> well, we threw out the team. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I think we're 2 0. Lost. <laughs> <laughs> Good question for all you American listeners. Um, what was the uh, 21st Amendment and what was it replaced by? Uh, I was surrounded by four of them, had no clue. The answer on the question, he waits to hear. That was that 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 was that was that was, that was, that was pretty rough. <laughs> I feel bad. I feel bad about that one, especially because you know. Cheers. <laughs> Why should I know it, not you? What do you mean? I think it's pretty obvious to all your viewers. <laughs> what number is that, man? It's only two! <laughs> it's Whoa, two! Watch, watch, watch the B-sign, man. Watch yeah. the B-sign. I told you the history lesson uh, behind what the feline is. <laughs> the B-sign is, okay? So this way. Not, not this way, this way. Yeah. Uh, unsurpri unsurprisingly, Napoleon have won the bottle of bubbly. But history, you've also won a uh, bottle of wine from Sherpas. You are not last, but yeah, we second, were second last. To last. Second last. Second last. We were last. Yeah, we were. We were killing it. We got half the points in first place. Trivia night with the friends was fun. Ajit wanted to go somewhere else. I'm obsessed with rooftop bars. So I found one on TikTok. <laughs> And apparently we're going there. Obviously. I think there's a mall over here. I don't know. I don't even know if this place is open right now. We've made it into the Ritz-Carlton once again. Once again, we're in an elevator in the Ritz-Carlton. <laughs> 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 and I'm completely not dressed for the occasion. Yeah, not at all. My ears are popping because we're going all the way up to the 52nd floor. And this one's not going super quick. So this place is called The Flare. Oh. Is it even open? My ears just popped. Oh, My ears are popping a lot. Why did Jeep bring me here? It's too fancy. This is too fancy. <laughs> oh gosh. Another elevator? Well, we made it to the flare. Pretty cool. We both decided to get wine. Something slight, something simple. And even though I'm full, I got some sashimi. Literally 20 bucks for three pieces, but hey, what in China, right? Wow, here we are. It's a little windy, because we're high up outside. It's definitely a cold night, but I can imagine this place during the summer is a hot spot. Well, it's the next day. Passed out real quick when we got home. And we have one more day in the city. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure you go ahead, like, subscribe, share, ring that bell. And remember, every day is a blessed day to be alive. I now know I'm horrible at trivia. I'll see you in the next one.